bottle vacs are a low-cost alternative to whole sampling applications. Treated to ensure inertness, bottle vacs are comparable in recovery to stainless steel summa canisters with the sampling ease of a micro QT sampling valve. Use the short video as a guide to help you assemble and properly sample using a bottle vac. Pull the bottle vac out of its shipping box. Visually inspect the bottle and its fittings to ensure the black cap is tight and firmly in place. Remove the plastic cap from the micro QT fitting on the top of the bottle vac. To check the internal pressure, affix the digital gauge to the top of the bottle back using the gauge micro QT valve. Zero out the gauge and record the bottle vac's initial pressure on the enclosed chain of custody form. Disconnect the digital gauge by sliding up the outer fitting on the gauge and pulling vertically to release. If taking a grab sample, connect the single micro QT valve. If taking a time integrated sample, connect the flow regulator. Sampling will occur immediately after the connection has been initiated. After sampling is complete, disconnect the sampling line by pulling vertically to release. Replace the plastic cap on the top of the bottle vac and label the sample with the provided sample tag. Indicate the sample ID, sampling date, time, and name of sampler on both the bottle labels and the chain of custody form. Be sure to note the barcode number on the chain of custody form. For time integrated samples, note the corresponding flow regulator number. Information on the chain of custody form and labels must match and be complete. Place the chain of custody form, the bubble wrapped flow controller, and the bottle vac back into their original boxes and return to the laboratory for analysis. For additional information, please visit www.alsglobal.com or contact your ALS project manager.